Welcome back to game over, guys. Press E. I can't find the E button, Brian. Press the no, 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 no. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Uh, time for reading. Excerpts from Logbook, written by Dr. Ivan Wansky. Wansky. <laughs> Wansky. I think yep. you mean Vonsky. Uh, do you know what we wanted to do? We played gods. Oh, nine. Telekinesis, telepathy, group hypnosis, causing mental and physical disorders. Damn. Creating disintegrated space. Ooh. Subjects oh. did not even handle a sample of the radiation. Bad. The ones that somehow survived behaved, behaved as if possessed, communicating with us in different voices, languages we could not even recognize. And then all of them died. Yeah. <laughs> One after another. Like that, I don't know, it's, it's shit. It does fit on, it does fit on, it does fit on. And then oh, sorry, some turned like into rock. <laughs> and some <laughs> turned into ashes. I remember one who levitated. All his limbs twisted, and he froze like that above the ground. A long time has passed, but it still haunts me. I remember it. Oh, I see it happening in front of me every night. Did anybody survive? They later told me that nobody did. <laughs> but I think one of the subjects could have survived. Do you have any idea what we have done, my dear Anton? Anton. I got the Ooh. right idea, and nope. I saw this shit happening and ran away. So, military necromancers summoning weird space demons. No matter how much vodka, summoned, I love it. summoned Beetlejuice, and the subjects lifted into the air, <laughs> dancing to Shake, 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 Sonora, <laughs> and they couldn't handle the Harry Belafonte. Your mother isn't here with us. Beep, 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 beep. Man, I would love if it, this was all leading up to Beetlejuice. Don't, don't angry stare. Michael Keaton just erupts out of the mountains. <laughs> All of your eyelashes turn white. Puff fear. Hey, it's quiet here. Ooh. I like it. I'm sorry, I'm just looking at that 60 frames per second snow. Ooh. Ooh. How decadent. Please shake your head as right. It is beautiful. <laughs> All I ask is that you marry me. The snow? No, I'm sorry, I made an obscure reference. I'm not even going to explain it now. Thanks. You're welcome. <laughs> you saved us all a whole lot of time listening to you talk on a Let's Play. Thumbelina of the Rift Tracks, there. <laughs> <laughs> well. Oh, Drew, it's your that favorite was exhausting. Game. Oh, it's Kiv. Isn't uh, Putin's mom on the other end of this? We'll find out. I mean, oh, oh this hey, time Sauron. Like this time... <laughs> Welcome back to Polo. <laughs> did we did we do that? Yeah. I growled. Hey? Hey Snow. How have you not died? I've chosen you. Oh. oh no. You are remarkable. I mean, yes. Just like me. Oh well, thank you. Humans are monsters, remember. Your mind, my friend. I'm loosing it. Slipping slowly into the abyss, and there is no one to give you a hand. What about you? And at the bottom. I I'm the only one waiting for you. Reasonable. This is all an elaborate Sean Bean proposal to his fiance. Oh, <laughs> potential fiance. Sorry. <gasps> this is how Sean Bean proposes. <laughs> Sends his fiance out into the Russian wilderness <laughs> in the mountains on a survival horror, elaborately portrayed <laughs> mission, uh, with a high special effects budget, and those who come out are the only ones deemed fit. To bear his ring. He's Humans gone through 11. Real monsters. Yeah. <laughs> if you are willing to partake in cannibalism, you're the right one for me. That's cha cha cha. Yeah. Ooh. Where we is? Uh. Russia. Scary. Night oh, Russia. That's definitely a tower. I'm gonna head away from it. <laughs> Gotta go fast. Farewell. Be -de 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 -de. All right. Ba -da -da -da. Ba -da 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 -da. I bet we have to pass between these two rocks. You did it. Mission accomplished. <laughs> I got gotcha. you. Oh. Don't go away, music. I, Shit. You were spooking me out, and now you're, it's even worse that you're gone. Mm, to be replaced uh, with. Oh, no, it's back! Paper crinkle. It's a flapping. <gasps> Something's a flapping. To the right. We did it, did it! Ooh! Ryan. It Stick to our own material. Papyrus! Okay. Huh? Oh, fuck. Huh? 
Death Valley. Death Valley. Anthony Nisney, a scientist and expert on the Sock Republic, set off the area. Wait, 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 wait. Brian, do it in the voice of the, the scientist from The Simpsons. Anthony Nisney, a scientist. No, wait, what? Oh, the hi, you Glavin. Oh, Professor Frank? I thought he died. No, that was uh, Dr. Nick. We're off topic. Oh, okay. Just read it. Uh, one of the mysterious constructions buried in the ground. Only here can you get the answers and the other unbelievable facts concerning the godforsaken place on Earth. Mm. I said off at dawn. If you have not seen dawn up by the river, Viewly, then you have not seen the most beautiful thing on the planet. This is a magical place full of nostalgia. Nah. Of what mankind has lost. Freedom, space, nature, wild and uncontrollable. There's no place for compromises. Because this region is as beautiful as it is dangerous. I have arrived in Death Valley around noon. The area stretches out over an area of 100,000 square kilometers. See, you have to know that you're looking for. Uh, luckily, I have a great guide. Uh, we stumbled upon the first building more or less after two hours of walk. Mm. Not much could be deciphered by observing a pile of ground from the outside, but the readings clearly show what is beneath is at least seven meters in diameter. It reminds a large buried church with protruding edges. It is also difficult to determine how many such buildings exist in the area. I talked to the natives, and from what I gather, there are at least 11 constructions scattered around in different places in the valley. Uh, what could these enormous mounds be? Uh, Many inhabitants claim they, they have to have something to do with the Tunguska event. There is a common ground for countless unexplained stories and folk tales. For example, I've heard of a please. hunter named Arlaman. As he was not able to find any game, he went deeper in the forest until he got lost. He was sure he was going to die when he found a strange construction. Suddenly, the ground shook and a secret door opened. A man came out and he gave Arlaman just one advice. Protect yourselves against the orange light. Oh, he got out of the forest after a week. Until now, it's impossible to confirm this mysterious meeting, but I heard the story from Arlman's granddaughter herself. I guess he told her. Well, first he well, came at fun. me with a sh Look shovel. That. What's that? Okay. And I shot him. Run away. And then his brother came out with a shotgun. Wearing some sort of Arlman And I suit. shot him. <laughs> it wasn't Arlman anymore. I need more Jeff Burgess. That was more of a... Oh, you're Rooster right. Cogburn. That was more of a... Hey, is uh, that a church on your left? Vincent D'Onofrio. I don't know. Let me check my compass. <laughs> There's whispers. Uh, watch out for I the hear monsters you. approaching your body. Everything is blue. Uh, ahead of you? Hey! Oh. I like you. You've been friend. Oh, hey, church. Uh, oh, no. Arleman's granddaughter. Oh, the snake mist. None Beard, of this... man. None of this is underground. All of this is scary. I don't like it here. You know what this ambiance reminds me of? A murder? <laughs> Mist. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Ooh. Huh? Hey there, Rumbles. That was the Vincent D'Onofrio. Sugar and water. Gotta get lost in the ambiance. Kingpin. Don't give a fuck if you're drunk or not. <laughs> <laughs> This tension is escalating. Let's get this party started. Sean Bean taunts us with confusing statements. <gasps> Let's get them 40s popping. Oh. Oh. So uh, just get busted, stay uh, fucked up, I'll keep them panties. Tackle popping. it, show you're the boss. Shoulder check. Demo no, 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 I'm not the boss, I promise. Demonstrate dominance. Who's show you the, how fast you can run. Who's the Tony Danza? Uh, yuck. I think it yuck, teleported into the sky. My home planet needs me. Oh. Well, don't go exploring. Go to the church. It's to your left. Do it. Do I it. believe in... I believe. You gotta believe. In, in you. Well, hi. 
Do it, Parappa. Go. <laughs> Don't forget the cheese. Huh? Oh, Chop Master Onion, if only you were here. Do it or it'll turn you into noodles. Chop oh, the oh, lettuce, no. lettuce, lettuce. Wait a minute. Is the canyon just forever? Yeah, we Russian gotta, forever we gotta, canyon. We gotta move forward. Russia is a dangerous place. Oh, hey. I hear paper. Me too. Paper always leads to danger. Or knowledge. <laughs> knowledge is danger. Okay. Alright. Sorry. I was All feeling right. it. Sniff sounds here right now. I sure hope we find another page so Brian can read for two minutes. Ugh. <laughs> Why do I have to read? Oh, uh, Just because I'm the literate one. <laughs> Words yep, for... that's our big secret. <laughs> going in the game over, guys. Brian's the only one who can read. Uh, burden on me. How fast do we go here? Okay. Uh, Dan's got this one. <laughs> yes. We'll find it. We'll An entry rushed. from the testimony of Boris W. Duh. A five-year-old boy, possibly... Exposed <laughs> to the unknown force that caused the death of 12 people at Vla Vladimir. Vladimir 30 complex. Damn. <laughs> Boris W. Hey, stop. Stop moving it. Ow! Yeah, good. Hit him. I've seen you in my dream. You asked me about the same thing you are asking me about right now. <laughs> the same man was standing behind you. Beard man. Dr. Gregor Antonowitz. Boris, there's no one standing behind me. <laughs> no one's here. Boris, <laughs> you're wrong, <laughs> Dr. Grigor Antonowitz. <laughs> the man is asking me to tell you see that there is an orange light. The world is more beautiful. <laughs> and asks you to take a look at the chamber number seven in section 22. Dr. Grigor Antonowitz, how do you know all of these things, Boris? <laughs> Did your father work in our department? <laughs> Did he let you read the secret files? No, Gregor, you son of a bitch. <laughs> I've seen it with my own eyes, all three of them. I've seen you taking people to God's eye. Oh. I've seen their skin burning and their arms being twisted. They were doing the Macarena. <laughs> I've seen the nightmares that it is planted into their brains. Do you honestly think no one knew about this? Do you think nobody survived? He has shown us the end of the entry. <laughs> next, oh. next time on Game Over, guys. I like when Dan Eric reads. falls asleep. Uh oh. Oh no. Someone has I, to stop the recording. I guess oh, the episode. Eric, wake up. I guess the episode goes on forever then. Oh, oh boy, here we go. Here right. goes the monsters. He's right behind you. You son of a bitch. The man is behind you with the orange eye lights. <laughs>